Salutations, this is Grim Devel. Welcome back to our Let's Play of Embark. Uh, I, you know, um, I thought we would start by showing, uh, we actually have some research going on here. Infant Garcia is researching, and when he researches, whenever anyone uses a craft shop, it has this little red thing. And it always makes me think that people are, like, upset. Like, it looks like an angry, uh, like it's coming out of their brain, and it looks like they're angry and upset. But it's just work being done, I think. Think. Maybe they don't like it, but I, I think so. I think that's what it means. Uh, someone set down a torch, so we actually, that's mainly why I was zoomed in there, because we actually can see over there. We can see over here now, too. I think you just put down a torch. So the nice thing, I didn't talk about this last time, but one of the really nice things about this game. Uh, so you, oh, well, one thing is that there are events, so that's cool. While working on Decent Pine Plank, Addison Colon had a flash of inspiration. Uh, you can either learn from item, improve skill at carpenter, and gain skill at carpenter, or you can improve the item. You can improve the quality of the plank. Well, no, we don't care about the quality of the plank. You are improving your skill for sure. And you gain research. Yeah, you're definitely doing that. So that was, which colonist was that? Uh, speaking of which colonist was that, um, I don't even remember anymore. Who was that? I assume it was whoever was... Our carpenter, I assume. Was it you? No, I don't think so. Was it Joanne? I don't know. Was it a Don? I don't remember. I thought it was someone blonde. I'm looking for that, but I don't see it. Um, because there are only a certain number of colonists, and because you, it's actually really difficult to get colonists, from what I understand, it's pretty difficult to get colonists in this game. The only way I believe you can get colonists is by having your partners breed new ones, which is why there are babies. There are children in this. Um, this is a three-year-old, Asa. Um, Asa is the child of Joanne, an infant. Infant Garcia. It's going to confuse me the entire time we play this. Um, so because we have a limited number of people and it's hard to get new ones, ideally we should be learning about these colonists and start caring about them. And I think that's really cool how it kind of, at least the way it should be, uh, ideally, is that it encourages you to really get to know your colonists and, and care about them. I do wish it showed a little more details about them. So Bobby and Adon are our elders. Uh, Adon um, is trusting, extroverted. Uh, Adon is our main fighter, even though he's a little older. Uh, and Bobby, his spouse, is um, our crafter, our main crafter and mason. She is inspiring. She is extremely intelligent, very resourceful. That's that's really nice. Very nice uh, to have you. Bobby, what do we have you doing? Bobby is doing, a, yeah, she first farms, then masons, then smelts. Why aren't you crafting? Because we actually have other people that are also really good at crafting. Um, that's fine. You will be... You're not our main mason either. You're not our main anything. Um, except maybe smelter. You know what? Let's make you our main herbalist when we have that. I guess you're our main hauler for now. No, you're not. Juliet is. Um, yeah, let's say you at herbalism as like a top thing for you. You're our main herbalist now. Congratulations. Um, so that's cool. Addison. Addison is... 30 years old. His spouse, Juliet, is 44. So Addison is careless, trusting, and very decisive. Uh, he is researching. He's good at farming, masonry, and weaving. Uh, very nice. Hopefully I'll remember that stuff. And Juliet, his spouse, is extremely industrious, as you can see. Uh, I mean, yeah, to, to be fair, she fell asleep on the job, very clearly. She was planting and she was so industrious that she was just like, nope, I'm just going to do this till I drop. She is slightly imaginative. I mean, to be fair, we don't have beds yet. And slightly competitive. She is average healthcare, uh, passable dodging, mediocre running. So, Juliet, are you our doctor? Um, you are. That's very good. And then uh, the Garcia family, who I feel like I'm getting to know the best. Infant is definitely our highest um, crafter here. You are extremely intelligent, extremely untrustworthy, as all infants are, but you're still slightly caring. You're an adequate brewer, mediocre crafting, and carpentry. Your spouse, Joanne, very conservative, very trusting, 
which I guess, uh, is, you know, you're, you're very trusting, but your spouse is extremely untrustworthy. So I hope that marriage works out, but you're also very annoying. <laughs> you are a competent runner, right? You are in our, um, in our military. You are passable crafting, passable herbalism, but you are not our herbalist anymore. Um, Asa, I think you, Chuan, Chuan, what do we have? Asa is just our, our actual child. You're extremely industrious and passionate and resourceful, though. Uh, I think you'll be nice when you grow up. But uh, Joanne, we have you doing mining because you are the only person that has passion for that. Um, we might have someone else do it as a backup thing. You know, if anyone ever idles, and actually we do have idle workers. Um, although actually you might be one of those idle workers. Who is idle? Can we see? Oh yeah, um, you're sitting. Oh, sleeping people count. I mean, sleeping is not really idling, but Bobby. Bobby, you're just sitting there. What do we have, uh, have you doing? I am going to set mining on you for one, just because it seems like you're going to be the one to do that. Um, if anyone ever does. Okay. Um, fine. So, uh, yeah, let's set some more stuff to do, though. Uh, in fact, it seems like we got more research done here. Yeah, we're at a level two workshop now, so we can make basic tools. So we can order hatchets, picks, clubs, and compact dirt walls. Um, we already have one hatchet. I say, let's just make a couple more hatchets, just two. Um, just shoddy ones. Um, so uh, more people can do wood, wood cutting. Oh, we can't. Because we don't have any axe blades or handles. We need those things, and we can't make them here. Um, clubs we can make. We only have one club. No, we can't make them because they need sticks. Picks we can't make because we need, yeah. We can make compacted dirt walls. Uh, do we want to start making buildings out of compacted dirt walls, or do we want to wait for something better? Uh, like a stone wall. I think we can wait. I think our people don't mind too much being outside. Um, our carpenter workshop, though, we can finally actually make sticks and wooden walls, actually. We can make wooden walls. Oh, we have a lot of research done here. We can make palisade walls. Soon we'll unlock the loom and a bowyer. I think we should unlock bowyer. I think we should unlock a lot of stuff here. But let's, let's make some sticks. Let's maintain a stock of sticks. I, I don't think our sticks need to have quality. So quality one. Um, priority can be high and maintain a stock of those planks. We already have a job for and wooden walls. I think we should. Well, the thing is, the thing is we have a finite amount of wood and the amount of stone that we're going to be able to have is pretty huge. So maybe we actually wait to make stone walls because we're going to want a lot of planks and a lot of sticks. In fact, I think we can actually harvest some more trees here. Maybe not this one, because it's young, but this old one here, yeah. We'll do that. And right now we just have our generic stockpile, but I think that's fine, because it's near our all of our crafting. Soon, though, we will want a kitchen. Uh, and I guess we can put our kitchen down here by where the food is, or where the food will be. So let's do that. Uh, I think we can, I think I feel fine making that now. Uh, let's build a basic workshop. And we can build a mason workshop now. We'll get to that soon. Let's build a kitchen, um, I guess, down here. Um, I guess. Right over here? Yeah, right here, or right here, where it's not grow. Oh. Yeah, it's fine. We can do it down there for now. We might. Maybe we'll move this. Ah, I don't know. I don't like it there. Uh, remove building. Pa hey, I pause. I, I'm going to pause it all the time. And you're going to know when I pause it because the music stops when you pause it. So that's fun. Um, and hopefully the music's not too loud. Actually, let me, let me look at that real quick. Audio. Let's lower the music even more because the music can be a bit loud. Um, all right. So kitchen. I do think we should have it down here. Maybe I do a little terraforming. Um, yeah. What if we do make walls? No materials found. Misc. Great. I can make doors now and stairs and ladders. That's really nice. But yeah, it looks like uh, we would have to build the things. I can't just put walls. We don't have any materials. No materials. So I do want to get that kitchen down. I guess I'll put it kind of over here. I think that's okay. 
And then we can make a little stockpile over here. Um, maybe we'll dig a little bit of this out. Um, and of course the depth reset. Dig, dig this out here. Um, and we'll make a little stockpile. This will be a raw food and drink stockpile. Ooh, or should it just be raw food? We don't want drink. Um, you know what? Let's do a new preset. And this will be raw food. And then we'll also do another one that's just raw drink. Because I don't think those need to be near each other, honestly. Raw drink. So raw food is going to be just food. Yeah. Let's take a look at this one and see what it is. So you also have raw material. Okay. Oh, I see. Because drinks are going to use this stuff too. I see. Um, so this should probably be raw food and drink. And then we will have one for just raw drink. We don't need raw food, though. This can be raw food and drink, I think. Stockpile. Where are you? Stockpile. Raw food and drink. And we can do that. Um, you know, right now, we'll just put it down here. That'll work fine. All right. See, now it's unpaused. Hopefully, that's not too jarring. Um, okay. Okay. Things are going okay, I think. Uh, we can do more terraforming up here. So it looks like underneath the lush grass is peat. Really? Um, that's cool. And we got some plant fiber, it looks like, when we dug that out. Hopefully we can do some interesting stuff with that. So we'll get the kitchen. Whoops. We'll get the kitchen done. And then once we get that kitchen built, and let me make sure the priority on this is very high. So they actually build it. We can do some research there. I think it's close enough to everything. It's not too far away. Uh, we'll do research there and be able to build a still. And the still we will have over here by the water. Things are going to be a little far away from each other. It's going to be okay. It's going to be okay. And soon, hopefully, we'll be able to figure out how to build some blocks here that are nice. Oh, they're talking. Asa is talking about the new torch with Juliet. Juliet and Asa are concerned that Bobby drank one of the few remaining drinks. Ooh, few remaining. Yeah, we need a still soon. Uh, we have 13 drinks left. Uh, I think in j uh, jobs, it sets our rations. Our rations are a little low right now. So workers aren't happy, but we, until we really have good, um, what is this? Have good uh, um, food and drink creation going on, I think we're going to need to keep that low, which is the default. Uh, we're also going to want to make beds and stuff soon. And uh, to do that, I think when we do that, we're also going to want to um, get uh make those inside i think we can do that i think let's actually start digging inside this mountain let's do it now this time we are going to want the depth to be two it's going to start here i think um how about in here i don't want them to accidentally hit that part although it might be fine yeah maybe right here like do that and keep going. Keep going inside this mountain. I think. You know what? Yeah, it's fine. Yeah. And then they'll build stuff in there. And I think, yeah, so let's lower the um, the Z level here. And here we can see where we can just put in a large room. I'm going to want to make sure that it's going to be roofed, so I'm looking up here. We can do that, start that here, I think. Do we just build one large room? I think we might do that. But let's uh, let's have it go in here a bit. And then, yeah, this could be a really big room starting here. Um, yeah. And that'll just be like we'll start ha we'll start that as like a, a general dormitory. 
Maybe we should have just had them come in through this way, but I, uh, it's fine. I guess we still can. Yeah, come out this way too. Couple entrances. And we can make doors. Let's put in a job to make... Or do we need a job to make doors? I don't think we do. I think we can just make them. Yeah. So we'll do that. You're hungry. Advanced workshops. Ooh, a loom. We researched loom. Let's also get a mason workshop. We're going to want that near where we're going to be doing mining, which is probably going to be down here, which is probably going to be near where our still is. Maybe we wait until we get the still. I don't think we need to do... Actually, we will need some of this if we want to do... Um... So we could put this inside, too. Yeah. Let's do that. It should be inside. Depth three. I hope it... Wait. Is all this depth three that I mined out? It is. Whoops. That was a mistake. Oh, dear. That was a mistake. Eek! No! All this... Cancel. <laughs> cancel. That's not what I wanted. No, that's all going to be... All right. So they're going to have to go down and then up. Oh, that's stupid. Oh well, it is what it is. Um, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to fill this in because we need a door there. Well, we can just have the door be here, I guess. In any case, we can do um, another two block depth. Starts here, and um, that'll come off of here, maybe. Off of this corridor. Eh, it could be off of this. And we'll make another room. And this room will be for the stone workshop. Yeah. Uh, maybe we want the stone workshop closer, actually. Yeah. Hold on. Right there. Four by four? Is that going to be fine? Will that be fine here? I don't want it to be... Yeah, I don't know. No, there's still something on top of that. I think that's fine. And then... And then come in... Here. Great. That's where it'll be. And I, I might still carve this out, but um, not yet. Uh, because, and the reason I'm doing it this way, even though there might be more stone over here, we're going to need the stone from this, and they're going to have to haul it over here. We can always move stuff around. Well, actually, I don't think you can actually move workshops around. I think you actually just have to destroy them, like in RimWorld or Dwarf Fortress. But um, I don't think you can move them. At least not yet. But uh, they're cheap to build. They're pretty cheap to build. Uh, have we built the kitchen yet? We have. Great. Okay, let's make sure that our research is very high. And, yeah, let's put on a thing to do simple meals. Um, simple meals. Yeah, let's keep 10. Maintain a stock of 10. Sounds good. There it is. Great. So we have mining to do, and we do have someone with mining as the top priority. And they are definitely doing their thing here. I think we can safely put a door in here now. Doors take, what? Two planks. And we should have some planks. So, yeah, let's put that right here and rotate it. It's a Q and E to rotate. Now, I don't know, does this show where the handle is? It does, and I think we can kind of see that. Uh, the handle should always be on the right. Cool. Well, although, yeah, the entrance will be, yeah, that's fine. <laughs> Doesn't really matter. Okay. Cool. So people are still carving stuff. Uh, how's our wood stocks? Not great. We do have a little bit of... Oh, that's peat. Does that mean that we can make peat blocks now? Can we make peat walls? Oh, yeah. We can make limestone and sand and peat. Great. So we can actually fill in some of this stuff. Um, like we can make these out of peat. And this. That's what we're going to be wanting to do. Fill in these holes. Uh, all right, that's all the peat we have. But we could put sand, but I think peat's going to be nice. Oh, 
Okay. Uh, but yeah, whoa, yeah, the zooming in and out of this thing can get really wonky. I'm sure that is something that they will be working on soon. Let's harvest some more trees. Uh, this one looks good to harvest. Some of these are really nice. Nice big ones. Nice big trees. All right, so we got our cook here. Uh, we are still planting stuff. Is there more stuff that we can plant? No, not quite yet. Uh, it is top priority, but I think that's okay. I don't think it needs a lot of attention. Only when there's new stuff to plant. So I think that's good. Um, no one's idle. Not really. If someone is idle, I think, yeah, it's because they're sleeping. We need to make beds. Um, furniture. We can make beds. At, yeah, so once they get this room out, and actually I think we might want to dig a little more uh, in here. Because I think our dormitory does need to be a bit bigger. It's gonna it's gonna have a lot of beds in it. So it was five. Let's make it ten by five. Yeah. Cool. Oh yeah, we can. Oh, so the light. Yeah, the lighting's weird. Like if if my camera is outside, I can see all the light. If my camera is inside, everything is dark in the world. So that's how that works, which is a little weird, a little wonky. Uh, yeah, we could definitely make the stockpile a bit better. We still have a little bit of room in here. And soon we'll start having more specific stockpiles, like we do down here. No one's doing any researching here, though. Um, we do have someone cooking as top priority, right? Cook, cook, cook. Um, yes, infant. Infant is our cook, which means infant will not be doing... Uh, workshopping quite as much because that's what you were doing right um crafting infant well you're doing carpentry i guess but we have a, a different carpenter joanne but when she's not mining okay i see hopefully this will all work out could always use more colonists all right you are definitely mining this out well this is limestone uh we also have shale um, and somewhere is a prospecting tab um, right here. Tells us, uh, oh, we have found coal over here. Oh, really? We found a little coal here and three hits of coal. Okay, we did find some coal in where we are mining. So we will probably, it looks like we already have that set to mine out. So that's good. That'll be nice. Um, I haven't gotten to a point where I'm using coal in this game yet, but we will. Um, no one's built the door yet. But um, I can set that at a high priority. I think that's fine. Because uh, once it's enclosed with a door, the game will recognize it as a room, um, which is good. Uh, you know what? Let's put some sand down, some sand walls here uh, on this floor area that we accidentally mined out. Yeah, and that's it. That'll fix our mistake. It looks like we have enough sand to do that. Yeah. Cool. Uh, I believe everything wants to be too high, which is why dig is n defaulted to a depth of two. I think our characters are... I think our characters can fit in a one high, but I don't know. They look a little taller than that, don't they? And doors are two blocks high. So... That's important. All right, we do have wood around here. It's just not being hauled. So that's good. Uh, mushrooms are growing. I, I wonder if it would be better to grow stuff on peat. I don't know. Uh, why doesn't anyone... Why is that club forbidden? That, that's wrong. What else is forbidden? Um, I feel Adon should have that club, right? Uh, items. Equip. Okay. You do have that club. In stockpile. Equip it. Alright, good. Wait a minute. You're not supposed to have that club. You're supposed to have a hatchet. Right? Right? Jobs. Carpenter. Uh. Adon. Oh no. Oh no, woodcutter. Right, right, right. Yeah, you're supposed to have the hatchet. I was... No. Don't equip that. What? The military screen? You? 
are supposed to have the hatchet, not that club. I guess we have two clubs. That's it. We have a second club. I think we built a second club, right? Why was it forbidden? So we could add someone else to the military if we wanted. I think we're okay for now. I think. Okay. Bedrooms are being... Ugh. Bedrooms are being dug out. Uh, let's get a torch in there. Let's get a torch in here. Um, event. Kitchen needed. Uh, we do have a kitchen. That's weird. We definitely have a kitchen. Um, let's put the torch near the entrance here. How about that? Or maybe right... Yeah. Um, I want to put it right there. Cool. That should work. Uh, let's go up one here. Yeah, I want to see the top level. Okay. It's working out. I guess we could harvest move more blueberries over here just to have more to plant for the time being. I guess so. Harvest. Uh, what else can we harvest, actually? Let's look around. Uh, dusk is coming. Or it is dusk. Night is coming. There's probably some stuff somewhere we can harvest that we can then plant later. I don't know. I'll have to look. I don't even know if trading is a thing in this game. It might be. Uh, I bet at some point it will be. But I don't know if they're like caravans and merchants and stuff. I have no idea. Not seeing a lot of harvestables, but I guess we'll have to wait till daytime to really check that out. Um, unfortunately. Okay, let's get to a level. I don't know. I also don't know if there are zoom hotkeys. That would be nice. You're sleep you're at least sleeping inside here. Soon we'll get beds in there. And people won't be sleeping on the ground anymore, and that will make them happier. I assume. Uh, we do have this kitchen, and it is level one research, which means we have the still technology. Um, also our orders, the simple meal, we do have enough simple meals, so, um, good. But you're just researching there now. Let's make a still. We, we, the still does need to be underwater, and, uh, when I was playing on my own, I noticed a bug in the game, and hopefully it won't come up here. But when I played a game on my own, I tried to build a still, and I definitely, definitely said still, and I set it down to be built. I did not set it down to be built built near water. Uh, when the still was finished, it wasn't a still. It was a mason workshop. Obviously, I had already researched mason workshop. Um, I wonder what would have happened if I hadn't researched mason workshop. I'm hoping that this game, when I place a still near water, it won't have that issue. Did I do it? Yeah. Okay. Placed. Very high priority, because we do not want to run out of drinks. Look, Mason Workshop. What the heck? Mason Workshop, it says. No. What? What is going on? Um, basic Workshops. Remove building. Remove. Still. I mean, it looks like a still, right? That looks like a still to me. Sure does. And look, it's got a little tube going into the water. Whoops. Um... Rotate you. Get you. Let's get. Let's go down some Z levels here. Okay. Okay. Get okay, you right here. Let's get the pump. Yeah. How about just like that? That looks beautiful. Looks like a still. Looks like a still to me. Still under construction. Priority very high. Okay. Says still. Still says still. Okay, I'm gonna leave you alone. Don't let me down. All right, where are, where are folks? Sleeping on the stockpile. Uh, hopefully our miner is getting better at mining. I haven't been looking at this, at our, at our pieces. We found pieces of coal at our, uh, at our announcements here. Uh, Infant has improved at cooking and is a rookie cook. That's nice. Uh, improvement at crafting. Improvements of relationships, although some negative things about relationships. Uh, they agree. Oh, both uh, Adon and Infant Garcia agree about how great Bobby McDonald is. 
Can I look at the relationship standings of everyone anywhere? Uh, I mean, I can I can have it just show relationship stuff. Wait. Oh, that's life events. Um, combat notifications, prospecting notifications. All right, whatever. Oh, is this conversations? Eh. Yeah, I want to see relationships. Also, what are the colors? Does that how like unhappy? Yeah, I think that's how unhappy they are. People are pretty unhappy. Um, which is not good. I don't know if they're like mental breaks or anything like that in this game. But we're going to have to get people happier. Um, hopefully, once this is mined out and we actually have beds, that will go a long way. Uh, I could start putting down some beds, I think. At least a couple. We'll want double beds, I think, because we have, you know, our people have actual partners in this game. Uh, okay, let's get... Uh, actually, we'll want to put them against this wall, I think. And then um, a little space and another bed. Uh, over here, you know what? Yeah, we can have one against this wall. Okay, and then um, we might as well do one more double bed somewhere. At some point, we'll give everyone their own bedrooms. But, uh, yeah. Uh, there's a torch around here somewhere. That would be nice. Let's uh, let's build that. High priority. Critical priority. How do we not have planks? Are we not... Um... No, we do have planks. Okay, I don't know what I was talking about. Actually, we're at a really high level here. We can make the loom. We can make the bowyer. Soon we'll have basic storage. But you know what? I'm going to take research down a little bit and make it low priority here. Because I think we have everything we need for a while. Um... We don't have the resources right now, like the manpower, to do bowyering and stuff like that. Um, you can do basic weapons. Uh, you know, yeah, let's lower resource uh, research for you to normal. And the kitchen. Uh, you're over here. How are you doing? You're still research level one, and it's still very high, so we definitely want butchery. Fine meals would be nice, but... Oh, actually, butchery takes a lot of research. That's why it's taken a while. That's okay. Still keep it on a very high, because butchery might be very important. I don't think we've seen any animals. Whoa. You know what? We never actually really took a l big look at our map. I mean, we kind of looked around, but it's a pretty big map. Two kilometers by two kilometers, uh, in theory. Maybe this is how we end this episode. Let's just take a look. This is an interesting plateau. Oh, it's not really like that. Just didn't load the water in yet. Yeah. It's a beautiful river. Beautiful river. See, there's definitely a lot of stuff on the map we could probably harvest if we just go out far enough. And a lot of a lot of trees to cut. We just need to go out farther. Beautiful, though. And look at all these little buildings. Like, oh, yeah. I think these are caves. Like, actual, like, game-created caves. And I think wolves live in them. I'm pretty sure wolves live in all these caves. Yeah, look at this. What is this? Copper ore, ooh. So like at some point, if we get good enough with uh, weapons and fighting, especially some ranged weapons, we might actually try to fight those wolves, take over those, uh, you know, get that like, get the maybe there's stuff in there. I, I could have looked maybe. What is this in here? Conglomerate. Okay, uh, we can raise our Z level, really get, really see these peaks. Peaks and valleys. Beautiful. It's a really nice looking map. It's a nice looking game. Very pleased with all this. Um, and I assume, you know, this is an early alpha, so I really can't wait to see all the stuff they're going to be adding, all the little um, uh, resources that they're going to be adding to the map, and different kinds of trees and harvestables and loot and all kinds of things. We got a little desert area over here. I like it. I like it. Show me, no, zoom, zoom. What is, why can't I zoom? Why won't you zoom? Zoom, I used to zoom. Why can't I zoom anymore? No, how am I ever gonna find you if you won't zoom? Um, I don't know. I, how am I gonna find our way back? So that functionality, what used to work and now it's not. Maybe we're too far away to be able to zoom. All right, let's zoom out. Does C bring us closer to the... No. 
I thought C was a button that said center, but... Okay. Uh, maybe we just need to get a little closer into the map here. No. I need to find you. How am I going to find my colonists? Uh, I think we might have started around... We started around, like, a plateau. Like this. Maybe. And then we went to a mountain. This looks like it could be our mountain. Could be. Um, no. You know what? I'm going to put in my other earpiece and listen. There's a little cave here. I bet there are wolves. Um, actually, I'm kind of curious. Can we Z-level down and see what's in there? Nothing. Okay. I do hear stuff. I hear things. Oh, there you are. Okay, so that is our mountain, I guess. That was our mountain. We were just... Uh, Okay, so actually, I didn't realize these caves were so close to where we are. We might need to be careful because I, I have a feeling there are wolves in all of these. Uh, maybe not right now, but uh, it makes me nervous. Definitely makes me nervous. Yeah, there's a wolf. That makes me nervous. So we're going to want to stay away from there. And at, a, at some point, we, we might need to hunt them. So let's think about that next episode. So thanks for watching, everybody. If you enjoyed this episode, please leave a like, please subscribe, and please leave comments. I really enjoyed playing with you today. Oh, look at this. They're actually sleeping in here. Is the door done? The door is done. Does that mean... Oh, it's not a room. It's not a room yet. Maybe the door is not done? Wait, maybe I need to... Um... Yeah, it's not counting as a room yet. Oh, the door's not done. Still under construction. Okay. Uh, but I think we can uh, make another bed before we close this episode out. So leave a like, subscribe, leave comments, and uh, there we go. And another door. I really enjoyed playing with you today. And I'll see you next time. Did I place that door? What's going on? Ah! Ah! It's not there. Whatever. We'll deal with it next time. I enjoyed playing with you. Bye, everyone.